Hi, my dear people. This is Catherine for you. So, I'm, I'm just praying for you all. And uh, I just want to let you know that keep praying. Don't let your faith down. And I want to tell you that, you know, this morning God gave me a vision where I saw another, uh, you know, this, this, this is not the end. And God has not stopped it. The water will still pour. And you will have still more things happening, more disaster that is happening. And there will be another dam that is going to break. And there is more gushing of water which is going to come in. But I'm telling you, my people, do not be afraid. Because God is there with you and he is protecting you. It is not the food which is coming from your neighbor or the shelter that is that, that your neighbor is helping you out. It is not the things that are coming for you and, and it's providing your needs and you're having all the needs, all the stuff that you need. No, neither the people nor your things nor the government. But your help will come from the Lord alone. Many of them are actually forgetting even after so much of disaster happening. Many of them are forgetting about God and I don't see anyone praying for God, praying for us, you know, to God. All are expecting a lot of things from others, help from people, help from government. But who is your provider? The provider is the Lord Almighty. And I see many are, are not praying in that basis. So God is going to do this and he is going to let more water into Kerala. I can't stop it. I kept praying for several days, but this is the decision of God and we can't do anything about it. Keep praying. My people have faith. The one who believes in the name of Jesus, the one who believes the Lord, God, they will be saved. And I'm sorry to say, but there will be a lot of death. Lots, lots of death. Children, young people, Nobody will be rescued. Nobody will be saved. Nobody will come to even save you. Not even one can help the other. The reason is because, you know, people try to tend to put their confidence in themselves and others. And you're just going to help. Helping is good. But where does your help come from? Your help comes from the Lord. God is going to do this for his own glory. So keep praying. Stop whatever you're doing right now because you have no time. Treat this day as the end of your day, the end of your life. Treat it that way and start praying. I didn't want to tell this to you, but the reason God told me to tell it to you is because you will not have any more facilities of videos or anything that you can contact somebody Nothing will be given to you. None of the privileges will be given to you. You will have completely disaster. You will face a lot of disaster even more. This is just the beginning. Even more. I'm sorry to say this, but that's... That is, that is the will of God and that is what God is doing. That is what God is going to do. And you will see a lot of things happening, but then this is going to last only for three days. And after the third day, after the uh, the bridge breaks, the, the dam breaks, after the third day, there will be full gushing of water. The entire Kerala will go down. It will also affect the neighbor regions of Tamil Nadu. It will also affect those places. And lots of people will, with no help, they will die. We can't help. Um, the only thing that we can do is pray that you survive. Pray that God helps you. Pray that God is merciful and he is beautiful in mercy. All that he wants is you to trust and believe him that he is the Lord thy God and there is no other other than him. He is proving himself to you. Today is your time. This is your day and this is your time that you sit and pray and ask God to be with you. And the one who prays, the one who is righteous, one who is believing in Jesus will be saved. 
will be saved. That is the promise of God. When you are troubled, call unto me and I will answer you. Jesus says, it is only the Lord and Lord alone and nothing else. Nothing else. Nothing else, my people. God is just showing who he is. So I want you to say, just keep praying and have your faith. No one could, maybe maybe the help is coming, but then no one, can, no one will be able to reach you. You can only pray and reach to the Almighty God. Okay? And uh, so after three days of this, you will have complete sun that will heal you from all the disaster that has happened. And the water will be completely drawn in into the sea. The land will be, you will be able to see the land. Like, same like Noah's Ark, you will be able to see the land after three days. So until three days, you won't be able to see the land. And God will let you to live in safety in your pasture, in your land. God is just proving himself that who he is. Your help does not come from people, not from your things or shelter that is given to you by the people or the government, but your help comes from the Lord and Lord alone. That's it. It is Jesus. That's all. So have your faith. Keep praying. Tell others, please share this video as much as possible because I just want you people to know and understand. Many of them are running around and helping people. That is nice. That is good. But no one is praying. No one is praying. I don't see anyone praying and asking God for help. And, you know, so please, 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 I, I just beg thee, please go ahead and start praying. And please hold everyone else also in prayers and share as much as possible. It is God, my people. It is God. He will show himself to you and you will know that it is the Lord thy God. It is the only Lord thy God. All he does is just for his glory so that you understand and know that it is the God alone, the Lord of all. And that is nothing else. There is no other God. There is no other things. There is nothing else apart from him. It is him and him alone. So please share this video and please do keep praying. And I'm praying for you all continuously. In the name of Jesus, you be saved and God is with you. Thank you. Amen. God bless you and protect you and keep you. May he make his face, his light shine upon you. And may he give you his peace. God bless you all. Thank you. Bye.